so that's Soul's just topic. Two ones. So, so yeah, just so sure. you guys know, um, which I guess that leads us now to the open forum, um, where we pretty much talk about anything and everything. <laughs> Uh, we didn't mean to go on to another subtopic, but you know that works out because I had not I had an idea of what to do, but I mean we talked about you know Dark Souls and Bloodborne for a while there, and then it became its own topic. So, uh, what you looking at there? Uh, just curious because we were talking about you know Dark Souls and the Division coming out mm -hmm. in within the next couple of weeks here. And I was curious. I'm like, what's after that? Because I'm really like, I always lose track of release dates here. Hitman on Hitman Friday. Hitman on March 11th. And uh, let's see. WWE 2K16. <laughs> I thought that already came out. Uh, March 11th, it says. Maybe this is wrong. I don't know. I don't really play them, but they're fun <laughs> as hell. <laughs> I thought that already came out. <laughs> that did come out. Um, oh yeah, duh. I was talking about this earlier. Pokémon tournament's gonna be out March and uh, March eighteenth. That's on fucking Wii U. Wii U. Oh, crap, dude. It's it's Pokemon. They're always Nintendo. I, I know. Uh, I <laughs> can't wait. I was hoping that it would actually come to PlayStation Four. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Somehow. MLB The Show 16. God, Quantum Break. I see the picture. Quantum Break. Uh, oh, yeah. So this is a thing. Um, Res 6 for PS4 and Xbox One. Isn't that... Res. Why does that sound familiar? Resident Evil. Oh, yeah. They're doing the... Um... They're, they're HD remastering yeah. 6. Which... Uh... I mean, I'll I'll probably play I'll, it. I'll, it was fun because it's got co-op, and I'll like play with Leon's a friend. Campaign was good. Le yeah, Leon's Leon's, Leon's is always campaign. good. Leon's was like classic Resident Evil. Yeah, Leon's is always good. So it was pretty much classic Resident Evil. Oh, I'm Leon, sorry, April. Then Chris, action-based craziness, and then the one guy I forgot what his name was. Wesker's son, but yeah. I can't remember his name. And which kind of reminded me of Nemesis, which was kind of cool. Yeah. It was like the big guy chasing you. Mm -hmm. I'm like, that was pretty sweet. Yeah, that was fun. That was so a that, fun That campaign. was the order that I played. I played Leon's campaign first, and then I played Wesker's son one. Uh -huh. And then I played Chris's because I'm like, I know Chris is just all action. And yeah. I was right. It was all action. And then you unlock Ada's campaign. Which I which explains played. Which explains a lot of stuff going on. Which I need to beat. Kind of ties all the stories together almost. Okay, so uh, I will probably pick it up and beat it. Um, I wonder if they'll... And I'll probably just end up playing them all over again. Um, I'm then, sorry. Yeah, they're going to have Resident Evil four, uh, 5 and 4, too. Yeah, yeah. I loved 5. I loved Resident Evil 5. I thought it was okay. I thought it was really good. I like, I, I liked it. I, I, like, I liked the... <laughs> I like the fight. I was gonna say, I'm like, I, I was, I was being legit. I, I like the fight scene between Wesker and Chris, but then I, all I thought about when I started laughing was the boulder punching. Oh my god, boulder punching! <laughs> Fucking like, Chris is apparently the Hulk. He's just like, wow. <laughs> 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 I was like, that's the only reason they had to justify him having those fucking steroid muscles in five. Yeah, for real. Good lord. Because <laughs> then you go to six and he's like so reduced. Yeah. Like he's still buff, but not as fucking six. Not in five where he's like, like Jesus Christ. Like, dude. Yeah. That was the only reason why I just like, punched that <laughs> fucking boulder. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Fucking boulder, man. Boulder. God, I forgot about that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna lose it. Oh god, I can't wait to see him punch a boulder again. <laughs> boulder punching. <laughs> I forgot. Oh my god, I can't believe I forgot about that. Oh man, I'm making myself cry. <sighs> Oh god, I can't wait to see Boulder punching again. Uh, let's see here. Um, Quantum Break. <sighs> Quantum Break, I can't wait. April 5th. Those fucking guys sorry. are Sorry, Dark ready. Souls 3 is coming out on April 15th. Or 5th. Same day? Huh, same day. Well, I'm no, probably no, not, not playing Dark April, Souls. April 12th, I'm sorry. April Still 12th. not playing Dark Souls because I'll be too busy with Quantum Break. Uh, Ratchet and Clank, April 12th. I, that's going to be cool. 
That's going to be a good game. I've always loved Ratchet and Clank. I played it at E3. It was really good. Um, a 3DS game that I'm getting like day one because it's amazing. Bravely Second sequel to I've Bravely never played Default. The, I never played that. Very good game. Star Fox Zero. Does it not look like a old game anymore? No, no. It's like it's it's like really awesome looking. But wow, they they updated the graphics. Oh yeah, but it's it's like classic gameplay. It's it's like N six. It's like Star Fox sixty four, but like new. It's like a new Star Fox sixty four. <laughs> I, I just remember when they first showed it, and it was just like this game should have came out during that era. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. Oh yeah. Fucking No Man's Sky. No Man's Sky. It God, that's finally June. almost upon us. This is so funny. Uncharted 4 got delayed again. Yeah, I know. I saw By that. two weeks. <laughs> Due to manufacturer issues. Manufacturer issues. Whatever, it's two weeks. Yeah, it's, it's two, two weeks. weeks. I'm okay with it. But May 10th. So it's official May 10th. Um, Can't wait. Battleborn, I played the beta and I was like, I'm still eh. see that that's what that's how I felt when I played at E3. I'm just kind of like, eh. don't like it's okay. It's a first person MOBA. Yeah, it was cool, but eh. yeah, I wouldn't that's... pay full price for it. No, um, I really thought it was gonna be. Oh a my god! Game. Okay, one of my most anticipated games. I've been waiting for them to fucking redo this franchise for the longest time, and it's happening. Doom. Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> 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 Woo! Hey, he's gonna he's gonna appear in uh doom actually you uh, no, you actually play as crash in doom oh shit oh man <laughs> they're going no, down down on this game oh my god i can't wait doom for is gonna be so good i'm so overly impressed with what they've done with this game oh, it's yeah. classic you're just getting swarmed by enemies like the classic doom i can't wait they showed off uh king of the hill in multiplayer and you can customize uh, multiplayer maps. I saw, yeah, I saw that. I I refuse to see anything else. I know, I'm done. I'm like, just give me it. Just I'm like, <laughs> I don't want to see anything for videos for a single player. I just want to play it. Um, Homefront: The Revolution. That's gonna be cool. I'm glad that they. I'm glad that that someone just disappeared. Yeah, it's. I'm yeah. I'm glad it just didn't didn't did, because huh. I. Didn't disappear. <laughs> I liked I liked the uh, the original Homefront. Like it had a good potential. Yeah. Um, very very excited for this game finally coming out. Mirror's Edge Catalyst yes. May twenty fourth. I love the original one. Mirror's Edge is really cool. Um, I really love the original one. Uh, Dead Island Definitive Edition. Dead Island One and Two is going to be on PS4 and Xbox One. But I'm I, surprised I that they brought that back. Like I, 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 I would play it again. I love, I, I love we'll Dead see. Island, um, <laughs> and I never got to finish Riptide. So, but what's going on with fucking Dead Island Two? Oh yeah, D Dead Island One, and then they had the the Riptide, Riptide, which um, wasn't. I don't think that one was made by Techland because Techland was busy with Dying Light, which yeah. I think that's why they fucking. I think that's why they put a hold on uh, Dead Island Two because the people that were making Dead Island Two saw Dying Light and they're like, "Whoa, oh, fuck. whoa, whoa, <laughs> we suck right now. <laughs> we can't do this." Um, <laughs> June twenty first, it is official. No Man's Sky. Oh, I can't wait for and that. And the game. Ex the 150 Explorers edition is so cool. It comes with like this like this statue of a, a ship and it's uh it's like red and white. Oh, it looks beautiful. I can't wait to play that game. Like I, I can't wait to lose hours. That's that. funny. So far only one Vita game in July. That's funny. Um, There's a Vita game in July. Sheeran the Wanderer. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> August. Deus Ex, Mankind yes, Divided, sex. can't oh wait, Ugh. and uh, confirmed for 2016, but undated, uh, I'll just point out the big ones here, Mass Effect got delayed till 17. Mass Effect got delayed till 2015. 2017. <laughs> Were you about to say 2015? I was. I'm like, that's already done and passed. I was, man, holy shit. <laughs> yeah. I'm I'm upset about it, but it's like okay, it's okay. I'm 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 all right with that. Yeah. Uh, Crackdown three. 
uh, Tied down. does not that's, have an official release date. That's yet. not coming out this year. <laughs> Dishonored, no uh, Dishonored 2 does not have an official release date yet. That's not coming out this year either. I doubt it. Uh, Gears 4 does not have an official release. Right. That'll be out that'll this year. That'll definitely be out this year. That'll be out this year. That's, uh, they, that's how they have it set up. Yeah. Uh, Final Fantasy 15. They said it's coming out this year. They're like, it's official. It's coming out this year, but they don't have an official release. I hope it, it comes out this year. I want to play it so to. bad. Fucking needs to. Gran Turismo Sport. Uh, I'm not really a racing person. Okay. <laughs> uh, the Last Guardian does not have an official release date yet. <laughs> that has to come out this year. <laughs> that fucking has to come out this People year. People are just tired of hearing about that game by now. Uh, Mafia 3. I can't wait to play oh that. I God. really, really enjoyed Mafia 2. Yeah, but I'm scared because it's not the same people. I know it's not the same people. I'm scared. I'm scared. Like, I just hope it's good. Uh, so I really hope it's good. I love Mafia 2. Mighty number 9. <laughs> That's oh cool. yeah, that's right. That did get delayed. It, it's it's cool, but I fucking want Mega Man back, please. Uh, Persona Five does not have an official release date yet. That's probably gonna come out this year, probably late, late in the fall. Yeah, uh, Rise of the Tomb Raider PS4 edition does not have an official release date yet. Oh yeah, but that will come out. I like I beat the story, and then now I'm just waiting. For the PS4 version, so I can like, yeah, do it more in detail. Yeah, because uh, I didn't beat all the the tombs and stuff like I did with the original one. Because I didn't really want to play on the Xbox One; it was making me mad. That's pretty much it. Yeah. And then there's uh, there's a rumor going around oh. that uh, there's a rumor going around that Nintendo they did it with Bayonetta. They have the potential to do this now. We know there's a rumor going around that they picked up. Oh, the Beyond. They picked up the rights to continue Beyond Good and Evil. I heard about that. There's a rumor that that it's going to be a Nintendo exclusive Beyond Good and Evil 2. Oh, you know what? Since this is the open forum topic and it's been a long time and a certain movie has came out. Yes. Tacos! How? (laughs) fucking good oh was dead. my god they could not have they knew exactly what they needed to do with this they, movie and they yeah, fucking they nailed it they fucking nailed oh it my god. ryan reynolds is like ryan reynolds is deadpool he was born to be deadpool ryan reynolds as deadpool is what robert downey jr is to iron man it's yeah. perfect casting yeah. it's perfect casting i i, I loved every i've never I, i've never it, it's the funniest movie i've seen in like two years yeah like it was just it's a fucking Marvel movie. Get your shit together, everyone else. God, it was so fucking. Good. I've never, I've never seen like a movie break the fourth wall so much. So well. like, I know that's his character and that's what he does, but they just, they just do it. it so well. And then the fact is, is like you know they did the whole like the cliche like origin story. Yes. And, like, <laughs> And like they know, they knew it was cliche. Like it was just oh, the it, jokes are just on point. Like shut up, or I will sew your mouth shut. Oh, <laughs> I wouldn't do that if I were you. <laughs> I love the whole like it's like oh well, what's the worst that can happen? And then it like it it went to a shot with like the old uh, the action Deadpool. figure where he's got the mouth yeah. shut. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Everybody. perfect. Like everyone just cracked up to that point. One of like, the funniest jokes I heard in that movie, like this had me cracking up, um, is when he's like having a nightmare. Is before he, uh, this was like after he found out he can't had cancer. He's like sleeping in the chair and he wakes up and, and she's like, "Oh, what's wrong? Did you have a night?" And she's like, "What's wrong?" And he's like, "Oh, had a had I was having a Liam Neeson nightmare." Oh yeah. I dreamt he was. I dreamt I was kidnapping his daughter. <laughs> I forgot about that. You'd think after three movies, he's just a bad parent. <laughs> <laughs> and it's like so sense of like, you'd think after three movies, he's just a bad parent. <laughs> like, like that's the thing. Like they don't draw so much attention to some of the good jokes. It just it's so subtle. It's, it's just it's all subtle, of it is like, so good. joke. <laughs> like and then even with a, I don't know if you caught the whole. Uh, it's like oh, we're taking you to the professor and they're like oh which one Stuart or uh what's his name oh yeah <laughs> these timelines are so confusing these timelines are so confusing <laughs> and like 
I like because I I watched it and then I watched it again and I didn't. And catch you caught the things, time. yes. And I like, caught things the second time like, too. He was like dragon, he's like, oh, which one? You know, D- uh, Devoy or her uh, steward? Because these timelines are so confusing. I'm like, how did I not catch that? <laughs> like, <yeah. laughs> and it's like they go as far as to make jokes, uh, like actually about production of the movie like yeah. when he shows up at uh xavier academy <laughs> and you literally only see colossus and negasonic teenager like they're the only x-men in the movie and he's at the house he's like man it's a pretty big house for just the two of you and it's almost like the production team couldn't afford to bring on all the x-men for right? this movie <laughs> <laughs> and it was it was a low budget movie and they said that they're gonna keep the low budget too it works it does work i mean like <laughs> Like, they don't need, like, a lot. Like, that's the thing. Like, they made so much money on that movie, and they don't have to spend a lot. I also saw the the rumor is that Marvel said, wow, we've seen so much success with an R-rated Marvel oh, movie God. that they're going to make Wolverine 3 rated R. I'm, I'm okay with this. I just hope that they don't. Fuck it up. <laughs> no, I just hope that they don't start to overuse the rated R gimmick now. Yeah, but I mean, like... they can't really. I mean, Deadpool and Wolverine, like, they're savage people. Yeah. There aren't really too many, like, savage, like, vigilante the superheroes day, out there. The day, though, that I see the Avengers or <laughs> Spider-Man it, it or won't somebody happen. go rated R. It just won't happen. It's, oh. it's already going into the whole okay. Superman versus Batman. Yes. The rated R version. They're coming out with the supercut rated R version, and I'm like, I'm like, I get it why it's PG-13. They want everybody to see it, but at the same time, I'm like, what the fuck are they going to do with that movie to rated R? Like, Apparently, because I, I read into this, just so, like everything's still there. It's just some of the fight scenes that are a little bit more brutal. Okay. They condensed it. They condensed it. Okay. Which I'm like, okay, what fight scenes are gonna be brutal though? Like I, between Superman and Batman. But then it's like, and then they others, said that there's like, not like a lot of like gore or blood. There's not blood, so it's no. like, how the hell is it rated R then? Like I don't know. I feel like they're just putting that on just to be like, oh man, it's gonna be a rated R Batman versus Superman movie. <laughs> yeah, because like yes. I don't, I don't know. There's never been anything really R-rated about Batman or Superman. No. Even in like the classic cartoons or some well, of the, some of the animated movies. They did the uh, the Dark Knight version. Okay. <laughs> but um, I mean, other than that, like, I feel like they're just gonna start tackling on like, oh, you know what? These rated R. Hopefully, they, this gives the people that did a certain movie. A chance to come back. A certain superhero movie. A chance to come back. Kick ass. Oh, yeah. Please. Oh, my God. Because, you know, they kind of first started with the whole rated R superhero movie. Yeah. And I love Kick. I, that's still, like, one of my favorite, like, superhero movies. I loved it. Like, it's like one of the greatest zero to hero movies I've ever seen. Oh yeah, <laughs> like it's so good, and even the second one was good too. Yeah, like, and like he still gets the shit kicked out of him in the second movie. <laughs> like, I just I wish that they would have continued with it. Yeah, I really want more. But there was a comic book that continues it. Yeah, I just I don't get into comic books that much, so I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> but shit, dude, just realize. In a couple weeks, Batman vs. Superman's coming out. Oh, I know. Uh, like, it, that hit me the other day where it's like, wow, that comes out this month. Yeah, it's so crazy just thinking about how fucking time flies. I remember seeing the video, the reveal video. From and it's like, Comic-Con man, this is gonna take, and... that's going to come out a long, it's going to be a long time since this comes out. And it's like, no, this is this month. It's crazy. I mean, it has been like <laughs> three years. But still, good lord. Felt like, like it was yesterday I was watching that reveal video. I love that reveal video from Comic Con where they're like they show, you know, he he's he's quoting Frank Miller's The Dark Knight Returns mm-hmm. and then it goes dark and like you see the, the Superman logo and everybody's like, Yeah, Superman sequel and then like bat the bat symbol pops behind and everybody's like, What the f-? <laughs> It's like table flips. <laughs> Tables flipping, <laughs> glass breaking. <laughs> But oh my god! And then I just can't. I can't wait for the Suicide Squad too. That looks so good. I can't wait. I can't wait. 
do you like do you still think it's, that it, it's possible if it's fucking jason todd i still think that that's the case if if they actually are that smart i'm gonna fucking cry i'm gonna be like it's jason todd I mean, that is I'm amazing that we may find out soon yeah because like they would have to kind of address that because they'd shown that part in the trailer we'll see if they they don't have to but if they they could do something they, in the movie even said like i the, it's the, all there oh, <laughs> it's, God, all, like, it's all there the like, jay the fucking but the thing is like the, even batman made the references like you know yeah we're tired of you know clowns like you know you know people dressed up as clowns like so the joker's already been established so like did he already die like what what's happening like i just i need to know for my yeah. own sanity like i think if if it is the case then that in the movie they will talk about they'll they'll start talking about like jason todd but it'll just it'll pretty much be like who is this guy oh he's robin oh cool and then boom it's like oh guess what the joker's jason todd this is like, this is what happened if they do that it's gonna be it's gonna be like i will give amazing movie dude i I will give schneider like so much credit if he fucking does if he pulls that off it's like okay you know what screw everybody that had you know complaints about it being oh you know this is a weird joker guess what it's not actually the fucking joker it's not actually the joker (laughs) like that would be so sweet to be like boom bitch i told you it wasn't the joker oh man I really want like, to just imagine, it. like, if, if that's the case, like, what he's thinking right now, to be like, you know, all these people that are hating how the Joker looks, and he just really wants to say, hey, it's not the Joker. And then when the, the movie finally comes out a while, he's like, what's up, bitches? That must be great like, to, like, have that information, and, like, millions of people are just, like, freaking out. Like, and he's just like, <laughs> he's like, oh, <laughs> only if you knew, like, like oh my god oh man yes we'll we'll know soon oh yeah we will know soon well i guess that goes without saying this has been it for live and games games cast i hope you guys enjoyed make sure to subscribe below um until next time have a great one oh my god i can't it's funny, like, I'm almost more excited for Suicide Squad than Batman vs. Superman. Cause, I like, am, too. 